We're joined not only by Manuel Margot, but Manny Navarro, who is translating for us. Gentlemen, welcome to pregame spread. Thanks for your time. I have to start by asking Manny how the hamstring is feeling. I know he came out of the game early yesterday. How you feeling, Manny? Un poquito mejor, un poquito mejor. O sea, amanecí, amanecí mucho mejor que, que, que anoche. No, I feel much better. I feel much better. I think I uh, this morning felt much better than I did last night. Good news, good news. I know they're keeping you out of the lineup today as a precaution. Uh, talk about playing back in Southern California. I know you had very fond memories of your time in San Diego. You're only about an hour and a half away from there in Anaheim. What does it feel like to be back in SoCal? ¿Cómo se siente estar aquí en, en California? Jugaste no tan lejos de aquí, pero ¿cómo se siente estar aquí otra vez? En el... Tremendo, tremendo. Yo, yo todo el tiempo digo que, que aquí ha sido uno de los mejores climas que, que, que he jugado. O sea, el clima eh, me ha encantado y la ciudad sé que o sea, estábamos cerca y nosotros viajamos mucho lo que es Los Ángeles. No, tremendous. It's, it's tremendous to be back. I mean, this is the, the best weather you can get. I've always said this has been the best weather. You know, I know we're not too far from here uh, down south, but the, the weather over here is always great. You know, Manny has, uh, he has starred defensively in so many ballparks. There are so many great highlights of him making great defensive plays, robbing home runs. I want to know what his favorite outfield to play defense is in the league. Has hecho muchas jugadas en diferentes estadios. Uh, ¿Quieres saber cuál fue uno de los mejores uh, outfields que te han jugado en, en un estadio? Wow, yo digo en San Diego, en San Diego, en San Diego, o sea, eh, como está un poquito grande, tenía más chance de, de, de correr y más, que la, y más que la pared han sido un poquito bajitas. Yo allá me, decía, me, me, me sentía bien para brincarle a los batazos. Uh, I would say San Diego. You know, San Diego has a really big ballpark. Uh, the fences aren't too high, so I'm able to, you know, run some balls down and, you know, make some plays out there. Yeah, we just uh, we just showed a shot of him flipping over the corner wall at Petco Park a number of years ago. Good stuff. I also want to ask Manny about playing on such a talented roster. And uh, for fans that have never seen Randy Arozarena or Wander Franco, how he would describe them to people as players. En el rostro que tenemos nosotros que hay mucho talento. Uh, explica un poco, un poco del talento de, de Arosarena o de Franco, de los jóvenes que tenemos aquí. Bueno, yo, yo, yo diría que son, que son dos peloteros especiales. Realmente eh, cualquier equipo se, se sentiría orgulloso de, 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 de tener esa dos clases peloteros, peloteros de, de, que te van a hacer la cosa pequeña, que te van a robar una base, que te la pueden sacar. Yo digo que cualquier equipo des, desearía tener uno de esos dos jugadores. No, I think both of those two players are, are very special. Uh, you know, if you're looking for a base hit, if you're looking for a home run, anything, you know, the little things in the game, they do very well. I think any team would be very proud of what type of a player they can bring to that team. Does Manny ever think back on the World Series run? And I'm thinking specifically about the really aggressive stolen base attempt when he tried to steal home in game five. I thought it was a wonderful idea. I thought he would have been safe if the if there was a full stadium because I think Kershaw heard his teammates tip him off. If the stadium was full, he wouldn't have heard it and Manny would have been safe. Does he ever think of that? Uh, piensa de esa jugada, él piensa que si había más fanáticos en el estadio, había más ruido, pero él cree que muchos de, de sus compañeros le dijeron que estabas corriendo y él supo más rápido que puede decidir de mover más rápido. ¿Hay algo que tú piensas uh, en eso? Bueno, yo diría que, que, que él no hizo ahí en ese momento lo, lo, lo que hacía normal, que él subía y paraba, él se, él se fue ahí eh, directo, él hizo tremendo, tremendo trabajo, yo creo que esa era la única forma que me podía hacer algo. No, I think uh, from what I saw, you know, he usually goes up and he stops, but in that particular play, he couldn't have done it uh, more perfectly. I think he stopped, he, he didn't really stop and he went to the plate as fast as I can. I think that was the only way he could have got me. Yeah, I agree. I, that's still one of the most amazing plays in, in recent World Series history for me. Hey, last question, uh, Manny for Manny. I know that back home in the Dominican, uh, that Manny is a big equestrian guy, big on the horses. Has he ever ridden with Johnny Cueto, and does he ride the weird little miniature horses like Cueto does? Yeah, sabe que te gustan todos los caballos. Quiere saber si has reteado con con Cueto, y él también tiene unos caballos chiquitos también. Si has reteado uno de estos. Ve, sí, sí hemos hablado, hemos hablado con 
con el que he montado eh, ha sido con, con Tati, de hecho eh, de Osuna, Osuna me invitó, me invitó para allá, para, para su ciudad, de ahí también he eh, eh, cubierto y realmente eh, yo hablo mucho con él, yo hablo mucho con él, de hecho él me escribió el otro día que, que necesitaba una opinión para comprar un caballo. Sí, yeah, no, we've definitely talked about it. You know, I've actually ridden with, you know, guys like Tatis and, and Osuna and, you know, actually just the other day, you know, Cueto did uh, reach out to me, send me a text a, a asking about some of these horses. <laughs> I, I still think those miniature horses, uh, that is a trip, man. I know it's a, it's a, it's a real thing, but uh, I get a kick out of it. Hey, guys, we appreciate the time. Manuel Margo, Manny Navarro, we appreciate the visit today. Good luck tonight in, uh, in Anaheim. Thank you. Thank you, guys.